As cold temperatures continue to threaten the borderland, both migrants and homeless people are in need of shelter. And now officials also need to plan for a possible end of Title 42 next month. ABC 7's Eddie Beto Perez reports. The Opportunity Center and other shelters are taking care of both populations, the homeless and migrants. Officials with the Opportunity Center for the Homeless say they have seen a rise in need lately. City leaders are now expecting the number of people needing help to increase by the end of the year. Deputy Director John Martin says his shelter has two issues now. The cold temperatures which they have to plan in advance and anticipate each year and the large influx of migrants the border has seen the past few months. When you have the two that come together, it presents a concern for us and that we want to make sure that we have available space for all. With the city's current situation, another issue comes up. But there have been occasions within the past week where we've had to say no because we've simply run out of space. The center operates five emergency shelters, one transitional living center for veterans, and four permanent housing programs. Their ideal capacity is 250 people, but right now they are 35 to 40 percent over capacity. The Welcome Center and the Men's Program are their two largest programs. Both of those programs are significantly over capacity at this point. Our goal is not to say no, mm -hmm. and so we will find space. And Deputy Director Martin also told ABC7 that the center is looking to increase capacity. Reporting from Segundo Barrio, Heriberto Pérez, ABC7.